the events that you're about to witness is a uh, recreation of the dream that I had two nights ago. I woke up from it and I said, I gotta get my head checked. As I laid in my bed asleep, I received a phone call. I got up to see who it was, and it turns out it was the gas station asking Hello? about my car. State inspection. They forgot to write down why it was there. Then I went back to sleep and was thrusted into a dream. It was very scary, as you can see by my twitching. I walked outside to see none other than the monkey. I made angry faces at it because it was kind of scary. And it made the same one back. That's a bomb? I searched my yard, looking for the bomb high and low. I could not find it anywhere. I even looked in the pool, but it wasn't there. Monkey, where's the bomb? It's about to explode and kill my house. I'll never tell you where the bomb is. Monkey, just tell me where the bomb is. I'll stop the bomb. No, I'll never tell you. Monkey. Ha ha ha, I'll tell you. have three seconds left. As I ran to my front lawn, I grabbed the monkey because I figured I could hurt it later. I ran out front of my house and then... Fuck you, monkey! Okay, so, the other day, um, I went to sleep, I was sleeping and everything, and, uh, I started, I was, I dreamed I was in school, and I had just come out of school, and for some reason I walked out in my backyard, and, uh, so I came out of my backyard, and all of a sudden, there's a monkey, and it tells me that it buried a bomb in my backyard, and I'm like freaking out because there's a monkey burying a bomb in my backyard, so I'm running around trying to find this crazy bomb. And the monkey is like going crazy because he buried a bomb and my house is going to explode now. And he's holding my house ransom basically. And uh, it's pretty scary. And uh, I ended up not finding the bomb, freaking out, and screaming, F you, monkey! <laughs> Go. Go.